microgravity detected. They are very hairy. No, nothing that interferes with memory formation. the station here. inside this container, but I have no way to dock with the station from in here. Inside. There's not an airlock anymore. That explosion took care of that. Maybe you can do something with the shipping containers. Hey, uh, Jessica, got a minute? It's my day off. Yeah, but can you run me through the container docking procedure again? I, I missed the training session. Ugh, Grant. Please, if I ask Gus again, he'll lose his mind. Are you at the crate docking control station? Yes. First and... Oh, at last. I thought that crate would be my coffin. Even the stale air of Talos laced with a faint hint of nicotine and antibacterians. Oh, it's like spring. You are my thanks, Dr. Yu. But I thought... Well, you're no longer running the memory hamster wheel, I see. I hope you're coming in after me. Would be good to see a familiar face. I'm transmitting the code to the crate I was in. You found Dr. Igwe. He worked in the simulation lab and in psychotronics. He might be helpful, but he's unlikely to approve of your mission, despite everything he's suffered. Though, I will note, he's always admired you and Alex quite a bit. Hey, uh, Jessica, got a minute? My day off. Yeah, but can you run me through the container docking procedure again? I, I missed the training session. Ugh, Grant. Please, if I ask Gus again, he'll lose his mind. Are you at the crate docking control station? Yes. First, enter the handling number on the container you want to dock. Um, where do I get the number? Look at the container, 
your grant. It's stenciled on the outside. Once you enter the number, you should see some options pop up. Select dock. That's it. The container just docks itself, right? Yes, Grant. It docks itself. They are all self-piloting. And I guess open opens the container? Yes. But both ends can never be open at the same time. That way, the interior loading zone stays pressurized even when the cargo bay doors are open. Okay. I think I got it. Thanks, Jess. Jess? Hey, you there? Okay, bye. What the hell was that? Dr. Yu! It, Morgan! Up here! Officer Cool! If we can't open the main door or our friends are gonna pour through. Get up to the catwalk. We'll get you inside.
Dr. Yu, again, I want to thank you for the timely rescue. I hope you recall me. Dr. Igwe, Dio Igwe, your brother, Alex, brought me to the station to head up Neuromod research. I have one, but no aptitude template. Was saving it, but, well, now might be best. Here, I'm sure you could make better use of it. Morgan? I thought... I don't know what I thought. It's good to see you. Is Transtar mounting a rescue operation? I was in fuel storage when... when the fire broke out and everyone began running. But they weren't running from the fire, it was these shapes. I had contained the fire and I was trying to reach the power supply when Al, Officer Rose, came and got me out. I'm glad he did. I didn't know what was going on or anything about those things. Everyone I worked with, they're dead, aren't they? I wonder if one of the creatures caused the explosion in fuel storage. Are they intelligent? Did they plan this? I heard all the escape pods malfunctioned. All of them. How is that possible? How did this all happen? God, watching those things move makes me sick. What is it doing? Oh my god, did it? I think I'm gonna be sick. It just made another one of those things. Like, you, like it pulled it right out of Enoch's corpse. Ugh, corpse, maybe. I don't know, maybe it saved him. It could still be Enoch. Does it look like it? Sam, promise me you'll kill me if I ever end up like that. Sarah will get us out of this. She got us this far. We're safe in here. For now, I'm going to check the perimeter. Hello, you're nice ahead. to see you. Four nine zero medical My class mistake. operator ready. Diagnosing bruising, abrasions, and fatigue. Nothing like personal. Try to relax. Good as new. Don't forget to complete a patient questionnaire. Your feedback will be invaluable. Morgan Yu. I'm surprised you escaped Simlab. Yes, I knew about that. I checked the shuttle logs when the rumors about you being demoted started circulating. All I found was you checked into the Simlab but never signed out. Not sure you could, but it seems you've escaped. Just like these creatures of yours, the ones your brother said couldn't get free. Wish I had better news. We're holding out here, but just barely. These standard-issue PPNs might as well be cap guns for all the good they do to those things. Only way back into Talos is through Cargo Bay B, and that's locked tight for our safety. And yours. You want the code? Help us fortify things here. That means eradicator turrets, and lots of them. To do that, though, we'd need fabrication plans and a working fabricator, and both of those are out of reach at the moment. 
The fabrication plan is in the safe in the security office, but the hull breach puts it out of my reach. Still, if you have a suit and are up for another walk, we could really use the additional firepower. Look, I don't know what you're planning, Morgan, but just remember, the only thing that matters is how you treat the people that are still alive. I am worried the lifts were sealed for a reason. But I don't know if that will prevent the aliens from moving through the station. The plan we want, not the reployer plan. Whatever the hell a reployer is. Are you there? Chief? Yes? Is there something wrong? I wanted to speak to you about the most recent VIP visit. Leitner, the pianist. Chief, if there were any problems, I checked the schedule, the roster. I did my best to make sure Igwe wasn't too... Igwe. Chief, I even had Leitner's cigarettes waiting. You did an excellent job. In fact, Leitner praised you specifically. There'll be a bonus for you in your next pay cycle. Take Nicole out for a nice dinner, all right? Yes, Chief. Dr. Igwe. Thank you, Chief. Figures he'd survive. Dumb luck, I suppose. Don't know if Wiggy... Uh, Dr. Igwe is lucky to be here or not. Might have been safer in his crate. There must be a way hey, to Dr. get some Igwe torts online. Dr. was floating in a cargo crate outside the ship. If he stayed there, he might have survived longer than any of us. Any luck with the Eradicators? Would be a lot better than these cap guns Transtar assigned us. These Transtar PPN-8 pistols are mostly so for long. show. They don't do much against the attackers. With the Eradicator turrets, you have a chance. Welcome. Maybe I can help you. Dr. Igwe is blessed. It was fortunate you came along when you did.
used to be one of us!
Power circuit checks out, and fabricators online. You did it. We're not done with you yet. So get back here safe, all right? Material found. Standing down. Moving. Scan complete. New psionic aptitude available. Adjustment required. <laughs> 